I've got a broken shoelace. Now here are some ways I can deal with that. With a new shoelace, with a soup bowl, with a can of Lysol, with a dawn to dust curfew on anyone under the age of 25. So let's talk about all these new voter ID laws springing up everywhere, okay? Let's talk about the problem of voter fraud, that's our broken shoelace, and the much bigger problem of voter suppression, that's our dawn to dust curfew. It would be nice, you see, if the solution matched the problem, assuming, of course, the problem you're trying to solve is the problem you say you're trying to solve. You notice how they've uh, switched tactics lately, the make it hard to vote brigades? They don't focus anymore on how much voter fraud there's been. That's because there hasn't been much voter fraud. Study after study has shown that. Of course, those are just facts. So now, new argument, they talk about how people need to have confidence in the voting process, that people shouldn't have to worry about fraudulent voting. Pretty clever, right? Because then you don't have to show that anybody, let alone lots of anybody's, has actually voted illegally. You only have to claim that some people somewhere are worried about it. And why would they be worried about it when it hardly ever happens? Could it be because the Republican Party and their media wing have been shouting about it for years? So you're saying, this is their other line, that you're okay with a little bit of voter fraud? No, are you okay with a little bit of jaywalking? People can get killed jaywalking. So why aren't you passing laws that require barriers on every street in the state to keep people from crossing in the middle of the block or crossing against the light? Or better yet, why don't you tell people, or at least certain people, certain types of people, they can't drive and they can't walk, that they need to stay indoors? You don't do that because the solution would be costly and inconvenient and much, much worse than the problem you're trying to solve. Assuming, of course, you're trying to solve a problem and not create one. That's hardly the case, is it?